this is the hardest working team I've ever coached, and I'm confident it's the hardest working team in the world. I can't tell you how many times that being more physically fit has helped me in my career. I write out a week before what I'm going to do that week, and I stick to it. I usually go six out of seven days. And every day at practice, you go out there and we're killing one another on the field, and then you walk off the field and you're the be your best friends. Doing a lot of sprints, a lot of 800s, and it's really just getting that confidence working with the ball at my feet. I'm coming out either before or after practice and finishing more of my chances. I'm doing extra fitness. It's not a matter of being ready and prepared. I've done that, but mentally focusing and visualizing certain situations that may happen in the game is really important. Athletes use visualization to prepare their minds for matches. Short passes, long passes, shooting. It takes a lot of mentality. Whenever I face a player, I say to myself, I'm not going to get beat by you. We know it works. We know it can help get you that little edge. And at this level of competition, little things make a big difference. If you can visualize yourself doing something, then it'll happen. If you can visualize a parking spot opening up, you'll get one. If you can get to a point where fitness is not an issue, you take half of the pressure off of you on the field to play soccer, you just play.